Hey guys, how's it going? So today we're going to take a look at Old Speckled Hen from Great Britain. And it's an English fine ale, 5% alcohol by volume. Original, rich and distinctive fine ale imported from the UK. So this beer has an interesting story behind it. This beer was first brewed in 1979 to commemorate the 50th anniversary of MG Motor Works. And the name comes from a car from the plant that they used as sort of like a parts runner or a car to drive from one area to the plant to the other area. And the car was parked near the auto paint shop, which over time, the spraying of the cars, the mist uh, from, the, from spraying the car went on that car and thus developed speckles on it. Thus came the name Old Speckled Hen, which I think derived from Old Speckled Un. And I suppose they thought, well, maybe Hen sounds better. I actually worked in an auto body paint shop myself at one point, And I can tell you it was always a good idea not to park cars near the area where they sprayed the cars or you would have a, um, a bit of a mist or a bit of um, overspray on the car. So it was always a good idea not to park the car near there. They sold MGs in the United States up until 1980. And... Um, I remember they came in a few distinctive colors. I believe the one color was called Racing Green, British Racing Green, I believe it was called. And there was an orange color, and I think there was like a bronze color, and there may have been a couple others. I think there was like a white and there was a black. But yeah, yeah, it's uh, which is kind of interesting because MG's... Uh, in the 60s and 70s were a fairly popular car in the United States, a popular sports car that unfortunately at times was, was riddled with reliability problems. And then the Nissan Z came along and MG and Triumph and uh, those cars kind of went away because the Japanese made a more reliable car. And which is kind of unfortunate. I mean, Nissan is Nissan is a good car, but the British cars always kind of were really unique, I thought. They just had a, a character all their own. So the big question is, how does Old Speckled Hen taste? Well, it tastes... Uh, it tastes a lot like... Kind of like what I thought. It's very distinctive of a... Uh, of kind of a British ale. It's a bit strong in my opinion. It definitely has a very, um, looking for the right word, but a very pungent taste to it. It's very unique. And after you take a drink of it, um, you're tasting it for a little while. Um, it's not a bad taste, but I can't say it's my favorite taste either. Um, the aftertaste factor on this beer is, is a little too much for me. And the flavor is really just not of to my liking. This doesn't mean it's a bad beer or anything like that or that there's anything wrong with it per se. But quite honestly, this beer just isn't for me. And unless, unless you have a really acquired taste for ale beer, I probably would not recommend this one. And this beer definitely was not frankly designed with American tastes in mind and that's just and that's just putting it plainly I mean that's just being honest with you to tell you the honest truth so yeah unless you're really into ales I probably would not try this beer in my opinion um I can't say it's probably really something I'm ever going to buy again. But um, it was an interesting experience, and I'm always up for trying new and different beers. And, well, you never know until you try, right? Well, that's going to be it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great rest of your day. Bye.